What is going on guys, welcome to a new video. So I'm pretty excited about this one to be honest. I've got three awesome products to show you. Each one in itself has over a million views on Facebook, but not only am I gonna show you the products, we're also gonna be looking at the stores selling these products so we can see exactly what price they're selling at. Plus we're gonna be finding the products on AliExpress too so we know exactly what we can buy it at. And if we have those two prices then, we can also work out how much we can afford to pay on Facebook. But before we get into it then, as always, I'm giving away a free call on this video. All you've got to do is like the video and leave a comment down below. And if you commented on my last video, then make sure you stay tuned till the end where I'll be announcing the winner of that video. So that being said then guys, thank you for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the video and let's get straight into it. What is going on then guys? Welcome to product number one. So I actually lied in the intro. I've actually got four products to show you, not three. But hey, I guess it's better to over deliver than under. Another thing as well, if you wanna know how I go about finding these types of products, make sure you let me know down below in the comments section and it will always enter you into the draw for the free consultation call as well. So here's number one then, I'm just gonna play the video for a bit so you can sort of see the ad um, and see what it takes then to essentially produce an ad like this that's produced over eight million views. That is a huge amount of people and as you can see, it's got 100,000 shares as well. The average Facebook user has anywhere between 200 and 300 friends. So every time somebody shares it, that's potentially that amount of people that's gonna see it. So 100,000 times 200 is a significant amount of traffic that these guys will have been getting or a significant amount of eyes on this ad all for free as well. It doesn't cost you a penny if somebody shares your post, your video, whatever it is. So this is product number one then. Now, when it comes to doing product research, there's a couple of things you wanna look at. Views doesn't mean doesn't mean everything. You need to be looking at the comment section as well. So I've gone through these just to save some, save some time in the video, but just to kind of show you what kind of comments you wanna be looking for are these sorts of comments. So can this be purchased? And if so, you basically you wanna find comments where it shows intent that people actually like this product and they actually wanna buy it. So they're asking where can they buy it, how much it is. And this is what we call buyer's intent. So can this be purchased and if so where where can you get them fascinating i want one bad okay now as you can see people are just absolutely loving this product and if pointed in the direction then there's a very high chance people are going to be buying this as well so that's the product then let's take a quick look at their site to see what kind of price they're selling it at and as you can see um, they've got a list price of a hundred dollars but at the moment it's half price for fifty dollars so fifty dollars is a pretty good price it definitely fits in within that criteria of what makes a good product to sell on Facebook. And if you just take a quick look at their actual product page, it's nothing special. So to me, this layout isn't that user friendly. It doesn't like go very well on the eyes. And then as you can see, they've got the looks review app as well, where there's just a ton of customer images and things like this will really make a significant amount of difference to to your conversion rate. If people can see that people have received this product and they're giving it a good review and they can see that the product works, it's just gonna encourage people to actually buy the product. It's gonna make them trust you more. So definitely have a good review app installed on your store. So they're selling it at $50 then. What are they buying it at? And all I've simply done is put smoke waterfall into AliExpress. And as you can see, there's a whole multitude of different ones you can choose from. Um, if we feel to buy orders, in fact, just to see like the most popular suppliers, you can see these guys are probably paying anywhere from, so $15 there, $9, $20. So depending on what style you go for, depends on how much you pay. But if we try and find one that's similar, so this is, looks pretty similar to me. So they're looking at $5 shipping plus $15 price. So looking at $20 delivered, selling it for $50. That's a $30 cost per purchase that they can afford to pay. So to me, that's pretty good. And judging by how many views they've got, they're probably having quite a significant amount of orders go through. So it wouldn't surprise me if these guys are actually um, buying it a lot cheaper than that. So that being said, they're moving on to product number two. And this is a pretty cool and quirky product actually. One I've never seen before. Um, and it's called like a USB mushroom, or at least it's what these guys call it. So I'm just gonna play the ad again so you can see what it's all about. So obviously that's a car that they're plugging it into and it's pretty cool. Like I can understand why it's got so many shares and why it's got so many views because that 
it is what I would call a viral product. It's the sort of thing that when people see, it's a sociable product being sold on a social platform. And that's just a win-win because going back to the whole organic reach thing, every time somebody shares it, it's gonna be free traffic for you. So once the ball gets rolling as well with a viral product, then you can just turn your ad off and just simply the amount of views will just grow purely from organic traffic. So essentially your marketing cost can become almost zero as well. So that was the product, 5.6 million views, um, over 11,000 shares and over 40,000 comments. That is a, that's a lot of comments. So I'm not gonna bore you again then by searching through the comments. You know to do that. Make sure it's a key thing that you have to do. Views alone is not enough because you can get a viral product, but unless there's actually actual buyer's intent within the comments, then you don't know if anyone's actually buying this or not. So that's the product then. Hopefully you like the product. Hopefully it's something new as well. I've never actually seen that one before myself. Um, and as you can see then, these guys are only selling it for $10, which isn't a lot of money. However, it's not. there's not a lot to the products as well. So you can't really get away with selling it for much more. You might be able to get away with $15. However, the way I would market this then is because it is such a sociable product, then I would, I would sell it in a pack of two. And you could say, something along the lines of um, get two, one for you, one for your friend, because it is the sort of thing, that, like the cool quirky little gift you could buy your friend. So you can sell say two um, for $15. And just to show you what kind of price these guys will be buying it at, you can see they're only paying like max $2 a piece. So simply by, by selling it in a two pack for $15, you're increasing your profit margin quite a lot. And remember as well, you're only gonna be paying one carriage charge to so that's product number two then. Um, in terms of like marketing strategies, in fact, I forgot to do this for product number one. I always wanna go through the marketing strategies for these products because it's one thing just to show you the products, but unless you know how you would go about marketing, then it doesn't really do a lot. So both of these are pretty broad products to be honest. So the way I would probably gauge it with this, I would definitely choose say an older generation. So. I'm not gonna put an age on that, just an older generation of person, definitely homeowners, because it's the sort of thing um, you would buy for your house, obviously. And then this, I would go for a younger generation, um, just because it is the kind of thing that younger people would buy um, and would enjoy a product like this. So I would go quite broad because it is such a broad product. It really is difficult to give specific interests. So I would actually do Facebook influencer marketing for this. Find pages like Lad Bible, pages that post viral content because these are the kind of viral products that are going to go viral. So that's how I would go about then selling both of these products. Moving on to the third product then, which is this one here. Again, I'm just gonna play the ad for you guys so you can see it. It's a dead simple product, but again, it's usually the simple products that do really well. So it's just a beanie hat with a hole in. So again, girls can wear it and they don't have to put pressure on their hair or whatever happens when they wear a beanie hat with long hair. And it's quite a stylish thing as well. Now I know we're sort of coming out of the bad weather at the moment, but Beanie hats have become like a fashion item. It's the sort of thing that people wear all year round now, even indoors, you see. In fact, I saw somebody in the gym the other day wearing a beanie hat. So it is the sort of thing that you can get away with wearing and selling throughout the whole year. Now, one quick little tip for you guys. You can see these guys are using a Google short URL. So what I'm gonna do is just copy it go into a new tab, paste it in, and I'm gonna put a plus sign on the end. I do this every time I see it on an ad. And what it's gonna do is it's just gonna give me some data on that URL just to give me an idea of how many people have clicked it. And as you can see, these guys have got almost 30,000 clicks on this one ad. So you can see people are definitely showing an interest um, in this product again. Whoops, that's the fourth product. So that's the product then, you can see what it is. They're selling it at 11.32 um, Great British Pounds and they're buying it then. Um, again, it's not a lot to the product, so you can see it's pretty cheap, so $4, $3. Um, these are all free shipping as well. So there's the third product. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Women's accessories is definitely, definitely a huge, huge niche. And in terms of marketing then, um, I would probably go down the Instagram route for this. Find somebody, find a personal brand on Instagram, somebody who's posting in their stories a lot 
And if a lot of these Instagram influencers will have PO boxes as well, and I would just send them one for free and ask them to be kind enough to just mention you in an Instagram story or not. And if you can get one of them to shout you out with one of them wearing your hat in a story, um, that would just be, it's just, that is just really good marketing. Moving on to the fourth and final product then, you got a glimpse of it. Um, just a second ago and it's a product in the baby niche the baby niche is absolutely huge um, it, one of the top niches in fact if people who come to me and ask me what niche we should go into then I always recommend doing research into the baby niche because there's just so there's just a vast amount of different products that you can sell and it's such a passionate niche as well what there's nothing that people are more passionate about than like their own children. So definitely a good niche. So in terms of views then on this product, it doesn't say it on this screen. So I've kept this one open because this is where I found it. And as you can see just here, then 1.7 million views. So a pretty decent amount of views. Um, and then another thing, I just want to highlight the comments on this because they're pretty good to be honest. So my son loved this. The mesh ones are a pain to clean. These kind are the best. Um, and then there was another one somewhere. Have you tried one of these? Might they seem good? Um, I saw that looks class, might pick some up. So these are people, potential customers commenting on this, showing that they have an interest in this product and they think it will be one that will essentially make their life easier. So therefore it makes it a good buy. So that's the ad then. In fact, I'll play it for a bit just so you can see what it's like. Ads like this, by the way, are dead simple to create. Um, if you want a video on how to create video ads like this, it's dead easy to do um, and I can do a video, bring out a video showing you guys how to do it. Just leave a comment down below and let me know what you want. So as you can see, it's dead simple. I don't think it's even got anyone's face in. It's simply, you can make something like this at home and just set a camera up, even on your phone, just video on your hands playing around with it. This, this is all what these guys have done. So that's the product then. Let's have a look how much these guys are selling it for. So they're selling it for $8 then, which isn't a lot of money. The way I would play it then is people, when they have kids, they won't only buy their kid like one dummy or one pacifier if you're American. They'll probably buy like a pack of five. So again, I would have different combinations. I would have a pack of three, a pack of five. You could have different colors just to bump the price up and give you that extra room when it comes to factoring in your marketing costs. So selling at $8 then, and they're buying it. It's not a lot to the product. So they're buying it at max, so probably $2 delivered. And in terms of marketing then, I mean, the baby niche pretty much presents itself. You can target um parents with you can target parents and you can choose like the age of their children so you would have to find out what kind of age range would be recommended for this product and then you've got exactly who you're going to be targeting then and that being said then that i'm going to wrap the video up there then there's four products for you guys hopefully i've shown you some new products that you have an interest in yourself and will go out and actually sell yourself as well it's one thing to watch a video but unless you put these things into action then you're not going to get the results and that being said then guys if you're still watching the video thank you very much i really do appreciate it make sure you leave a comment down below make sure you like the video to be entered into the contest to win the one-to-one -one call and that being said then, let's get into announcing the previous winner. Here we are then on the previous video. First thing I wanna say is a massive thank you. 75 likes on the video is just a crazy amount of likes. So very much appreciated. Um, and please do keep it coming then. Don't forget to like this video. 674 views and 64 comments, which is just awesome. So I'm gonna copy the video URL, hand, head over to the random comment picker, get YouTube comments, and then let's start the raffle then. Who's it gonna to be today? <laughs> I've just had a call today, by the way. Um, really good course, really good speaking to you guys actually and getting to know your kind of like your background story, what you're doing, where you're going, um, and the kind of results you produce as well because everybody's different and everybody kind of finds success at different stages. But anyway, so the winner of the previous video then is called It's Matthew and his comment was, let's play a drinking game Let's drink a shot every time Jack says then. So apologies for that, but I think I do say then quite a lot in my videos. But anyway, Matthew, you're the winner, mate. Make sure you hit me up in the comment section of this video um, or send me a DM, whatever it is, uh, get in touch and we'll get that call arranged. And that being said then guys, thanks for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one.